Change to horizontal, turn the lock. One of the things that is, makes things a little bit easier is just to have a very small amount of, of uh, cruise stitch regulation. A cruise is when we have a certain number of stitches per inch, but then when we're stationary, the needle just comes out of the work and you set how many stitches per minute that is. So I'm just gonna put it on 50. So it just means that the needle will come out of the work and it means I don't have to push against the needle that's stuck uh, in the down position when I come to a stop like that. So I'm going to be good and do vertical down here. I've done the mats bigger than my final finish size so that I've got a bit of leeway so I can effectively just trim off this or it'll be within the binding of the edge of my place mats. I'm kind of using my fingernails just to make sure that, because these are fairly small pieces of fabric, relatively small pieces of fabric compared to a quilt. So what I'm trying to do is make sure that it's nice and flat. Now, what I could have done is use the 505 spray just to hold it in place. Um, but I decided since it was on the frame, I didn't want to mess the frame up, that I would not do that. Just smooth it out. I've got, I've got one side down, so it's not too bad. Trying to keep it as even as possible. Slightly off on that one. holding that one in place. If I just miss it, I'm just gonna, I just take off the, the channel lock, just move it over until it pinches it again. It doesn't matter if it's not perfect. <laughs> 